Hi gamers, I'm Cyber Settler, and today we're playing Interstellar Rift. And today what we're going to do is we're going to start uh, with a task. It will take me several uh, videos probably to do this. And the idea is to make a station. And uh, a station is uh, good uh, at certain point of the game if you want to streamline like your mining or production and uh, trading as well because um, I will show you uh, um, what I design here um, so this is what I want to build it's called a deep space 2 station and basically it uh, uh, the important thing is that it has this uh, drone bay and this drone bay um, can um, there you can uh, produce drones trading drones uh, cargo drones uh, mining drones and combat drones and and uh, with it you can uh, leave this um, uh, station uh, producing or mining resources or trading and then uh, you can come back and gather whatever you need also um, I have eight um, large containers so it can hold a decent amount of um, resources and yeah this is what what I want to build but for that you can see here the 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 materials that I need and that's a lot like uh, 330,000 um, iron 107,000 um, copper and so on but one of the of the materials that is uh, harder to find is this uh, crystal vectorium I can um, I can craft it with uh, quartz I need quartz so this is what we are going to do today we're going to go um, to get some quartz in a tier 3 system that I found where um, it says that there is uh, quartz in that system and hopefully we um, we can gather the things that we need and next uh, to build this station since it's a lot of materials uh, that uh, you need um basically it uh, i cannot do it uh, from a starter station or any of the faction stations so what i will uh, do is that i will i will build this ship the mammoth so this ship can hold all the materials that uh, that I need to build the station and I have uh, to equip it with a ship editor so it can uh, build the station so first we have to build this one uh, mine all the resources and fill this uh, uh, ship with all the, what it needs to build the station and then this ship has to go off and, and build it and uh, I will do this in a system uh, in the system I'm currently in that is rich in uh, copper because frequently this is a like a bottleneck uh, resource because it's not uh, abundant not as abundant for example as iron um, but then as you can see there are several steps uh, that we have to perform in order to have the 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 station so let's go back and i won't be uh we're going to go to a tier 3 system and uh, the skrills uh, that the population of skrills there is high or the influence of the skrills there is high so um i won't be coming very often uh down here so uh, 
we're going to set up the cartridge to automatically mine um, quartz. Yeah, and yeah, if we find skrills there, we better run because this this ship is not that um, that strong. I'm currently I'm in the uh, interstellar mining uh, mobile factory, sorry, and. And this doesn't hold very much. Huh. So they came a bunch of them already. Okay, but we are not we are not in the in the tier three three system. So I won't bother with these ones right now because Okay, so I set up already the for destination in the rift generator. So this is the the ship we are currently in. This is the interstellar um, mobile factory. is a is is a trekkie ship. It's a Star Trek. Oh, they they keep coming. Okay, but they're far away. So and that and that system the the skrills are powerful. So let's engage this the the system I I selected the Trunord Trunorinium. <laughs> That's hard to pronounce. And here you can see the resources. It has some some quartz. So let's engage. So here we go. And as soon as we get there, so we need to to find um, uh, an asteroid belt, and then uh, go for this um, quartz hunting. And the rest uh, we can. The rest is not um, that problem. E e even the the, the alum aluminum. I have aluminum. So we need about sixteen uh, units of uh, quartz. 16 or 17 will do, I think. So let's let's uh, turn it on. So now it's on. We're looking for the for the um, quartz already, and now we're going to travel to. Uh, some asteroid belt. We need uh, then to set our uh, sensors to look for the to filter the, um, the quartz. Uh, 
and let's see where can we find ah there there is uh, an asteroid belt let's target it and fly to it Uh, there are two asteroid belts but they are like in the middle of nowhere there's no planet or moon nearby Okay, so we are we arrived. So hopefully the 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 asteroids will start spawning. Oh, strange. I don't see any asteroids. We are we are pretty close and there's nothing. Okay, so that's uh, strange. This asteroid belt doesn't contain any asteroid, so that's curious. Nope, nothing. And the other one is... There's a two and a three. Okay. Let's go. What was. What is that? The, the three? That's a two. Let's go there then. Hmm. Very strange. I don't know if, if that's a bug or a feature. But we have to keep an eye on 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 our energy or power reserves because probably they are down. Because we have uh, traveled a lot now, a great distance. I tend to miss the the target when it's uh, when there's nothing slowing me down. Usually there's a planet or moon that slows down the the, the ship.
Okay, so we are in the second one. Ah, now this one has some. Okay. So there we are. I need to uh, check the. Okay, that's not. Well, this this ship has a lot of um, a lot of batteries, so it. Um, It's not likely to run out of uh, of power that that quickly. So uh, this ship has four nacelles, and each nacelle has a set of batteries. I'm curious. It looks probably this is water. I don't know what I'm looking for um, in terms of um, what color are these asteroids? The, uh, the ones that contain um, quartz. Uh, it seems that there's something here. Uh, okay. Down. No. Up. Uh huh. There's something. Oh, that's a huge. No, but but it's down there, right? Down. Could it be? It could be this huge asteroid, but I'm not ah there. Ah, now. We're getting close. Is this little guy here? Could be. What color is that? There. Well, that's a lot of quartz. Is that asteroid we have in front? It seems to be, and it has a lot. There, yes, it was that one, <clears throat> but the color is really unremarkable. Uh, it's like brownish, I don't know. It's like any other asteroid. Well, I think the only remarkable asteroids I know of is uh, water. Because otherwise, um, for me, all all of them look the same. Okay, I wonder how much we we got there. It said that it was a lot of um, like the sensors were picking up a big uh, signal, but. I have no idea how much. This is the first time I, I um, mine uh, quartz. So that's nothing there. Maybe these things are... I wonder if one of them contains like silver or something. We're just flying, flying past them. But I want to focus on the on the quartz because I don't want to be here like uh, long. Am I picking up something there? Ah, yes. It seems that. In this direction, yeah, there's something here. 
there's something here. Which guy uh, is that one? I think it's that one. Ah, uh, it was not that one, but we picked, we've mined it already. Okay, that's two of them. I should, I think I should go down and and check that um, we can still we can still mine because if it's if 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 we get um, because I I'm not sure if they if these uh, quartz come in like high yield or if it comes like mixed with other materials if it comes with iron or something um, then the the extractor gets yeah clogged let's say let's let's put it like that and i hear the the the, the extractor working so it could be that it's um, stuck or clogged Yes, look at that. It comes with iron. Oh, but we have... Look at that. We have what we need. 20. That's great. So let's get out of here immediately. Yes, I don't want... Like... Um, to... Yeah, we don't need to to stay here longer than than we should. Or the other way around. We shouldn't stay here longer than needed. Okay, but that's nice. Um, 20... Twenty quarts. Twenty quarts. That's not bad. So, and you saw that it comes with stuff, right? Like it comes with um, iron. Iron is so um, so abundant in this game. It's everywhere. I think I don't know in 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 real in real life. Probably I don't know. Carbon is more uh, abundant than iron. Okay, so let's go. Um, I was seeing if we can pick something else. Okay, but I guess that we can return now. So let's see, I want to reach, go back to where we were now. So we were here, we're going back. Um, to go to um, tier 3 systems, you need uh, the tier 3 uh, rift generator cartridge. So, if you don't have it, um, you will... You won't be able to, to rift to this. I'm curious about what, what do we have here? 
Wow, a refinery station tier 3. That's curious. Okay, so... I see that this system is uh, more or less... And also a trading... Emporium. So... Let's go there. Just to check it out. So this system is, is uh, developed. I saw that the Skrill was... There was a strong... Skrill population, apparently. And that means that... They can attack. At any moment, if we are like, if we are in a station, I don't remember now if the Skrill population it tends to 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 be concentrated on some areas, like close to the star. I think I don't remember. Wow. There's a lot of stuff here. Supply outpost. Okay, so many things here. So this is a refinery station. I wonder what what can we find here? And let's see um, at the end how much we we've got from uh, our mining session. I saw twenty there, but. Maybe there's more? Or at least the, the excavator was not... Empty. This, the extractor, sorry. Extractor. Oh, no, it's all metal. So we got 20 at the end. Okay, that's good. I think that, that was more than what I... I expected. And this was in two um, asteroids. So the yield is not um, that scarce. I think iridium and osmium are scarcer, right? What each asteroid yields. Okay, they have. So this is the one we want to to um, have, like to craft this uh, vector crystal vectorium. They don't have any right now. Okay, so that's it, and yeah, they sell. Um, Aluminium, aluminium as well. Okay, but currently we can just go back. Oh, now we are under attack. Okay, you wanted to see action in this video, right? <laughs> 
Let's see how how long we can we can um, we can hold because as I said this this ship is not ah but they are killing the drones are just taking care of them I think that was all I think I'm getting here in trouble because this was not that close ah let's kill them and let's see what they have wow look at that more of them we have to target the hunter because the hunter the hunter is um, it has it has some I don't know I think some explosives Wow, look at that. It's already 25%. Okay, who's shooting at me? like when they go like towards the the others because then I cannot like the other drones because I run the risk to shoot at them and then we will be in trouble why this it has such a hard shell this one Okay, something is burning, I hear it from here. But I just want to see if... Hopefully they are not coming, I want to see... Um uh, I, I increased my rank with... Uh with its with the sentinels because i was uh real close to to 3000 yeah there are a lot of good things but i cannot like and like um be here too much Because there's someone, some Skrills close by and I'm already damaged. So what we're going to do is that we are going to go back. Oh, incoming missile, I told you. Yeah. That's a uh, bye-bye for the missile. <laughs> so you saw that, right? Um, yeah, I was not wrong. Like, I couldn't just stay there because uh, there were more Skrills. And these ones, I think um, they would have, uh, like, gotten the best of me. Okay, so... Uh, let's stop it here and let's open the rift this ship is not meant for this system i i, I would regard this ship 
tier 2 in any case Let's check Yeah, the, the armors, um, armor is down a bit Let's see Yeah, so the armor is down, but the the hole is a hundred percent. That's good. And I hear that something is burning. And I should check that out. So let's head for uh, one of the stations. Weapons factory. Down there. Okay, yes, the probably the um, life support is clogged with uh, with carbon because something was burning or it's still burning. I have to check it that out, but I don't want to check that in the middle of nowhere. So you saw how aggressive the, the screws are in that system, right? That this is what happens when the when the screw level is so high. Okay, let's see. Uh, what's What do we have? Well, it seems that there's nothing... And this is still mining, of course. Yeah, that's it. Ah, uh, not this one, this one. Okay. We can put this down. So it seems that we don't have uh, more... Nothing else is damaged. Well, let's see. It seems that everything is good. Okay, just that I have to... Yeah, everything is good because the 
if it says that the device is in cooldown that in it means that um yeah the nanobots repaired everything oh that's great that's great so we can we can relax and here what do we have yes what i told you uh, this clock with karma okay so we um we were successful we um completed the task we set for this uh, um, episode so we have the quartz now with that i will make some uh these uh, vectorium crystals and this we need uh for the um, for the station because the 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 drone bay requires this vectorium crystal so um yeah that's tier three uh device i think but i think uh, if the if the station doesn't have the the drone bay then i don't know it's not that useful because the drone bay lets you as i said trade and mine while you are not in the in the station so i think um it's worth it so that's everything for this episode i hope you enjoyed the video and hope to see you in the next one this is cyber settler signing off <laughs>